another E-Team exclusive. Signs of progress or simply eyesores. While one Cleveland neighborhood is seeing a lot of construction, the equipment coming with it is really crowding up the community. The E-Team's Kevin Berry spoke with neighbors in the Detroit Shoreway area. And Kevin, they call the dumpsters a necessary evil. Yeah, for just the second time in two weeks, a big dumpster ended up in a spot in the Detroit Shoreway. It didn't belong. This big one covered the sidewalk. It was just removed yesterday evening, but the company that places those dumpsters say it all comes down to having a lot of construction going on in a place where the homes are packed very close together. Neighbors were frustrated that that dumpster ended up covering up the entire sidewalk and sticking out of the front yard without permission from the city. And a few weeks ago, a similar dumpster was improperly placed in the street just a few blocks away. After we called that dumpster company, the city called them as well, and they said they wanted it gone by the end of the day. This morning, obviously, we can see that dumpster is gone, but the damage that those heavy dumpsters leave on the tree lawn here on a property that is actually not the one getting renovated is often what's left behind. And we mentioned how this happens in those close, tight communities. They say it's happening in Detroit Shoreway. A dumpster company says they have similar problems over in Tremont as well. In Cleveland, I'm Kevin Barry for the E-Team.